All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Spin Tires. We are uh, going for a two-point conversion here as we try to fit ourselves through the uprights of these two trees. Uh, that was probably a big mistake here. We're almost there. Look, we can see the truck we are trying to rescue with this fuel. And now we're actually... Oh, God, if we get stuck here not a few meters from our destination, that would be a terrible thing indeed. I tried to go through here because to the right is a giant gully. There, oh, oh! And I didn't want to get stuck in there. There's a bunch of rocks. We've already discovered that this truck is no good with the rocky situations. Hey, Rocky! All right, let's try. Oh. Yeah, okay, yeah, like that. Oh, that was mad skills, everybody. Mad skills. All right, now I just got to avoid tipping in this gully, as I've said. Oh, God. Oh, dear. Okay. Ha, ha, ha. We're going to do it. I think technically we've actually already done it. And... Like a glove. Sort of. <laughs> Whew. Okay, so now we change truck to this guy. And I should be able to... Or no, do I have to be that in the other truck? All right, change truck. I am looking at the fuel. No, I don't want to fuel. I want to fuel this guy. Oh, am I not in range yet? Dang it. Oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna deliver my fuel upside down. All right, now, yeah, there we go. Yeah, I wish you could say not all the liters, but I guess we're going to fuel up this guy. 400 liters out of his possible 18. That was a, that was a, a mighty, a mighty delivery indeed, little blue truck. I'm sorry I ever doubted you, although to be honest, you earned that doubt by by failing to engage or properly uh, secure your location due to your parking brake failure in the previous episodes, but we did it. So now, now, we are going to change truck to the E7310. We can start the engine. Yaus! Listen to that! And let's actually... What do we need to do? Our original plan is to meet up with the D-537 to load it up with long logs and deliver it to this northerly... Is that north? Southerly, excuse me. <laughs> the opposite of what I said. Uh, southwest objective and just eliminate it in one fell swoop. Uh, I'm not sure if the, the truck I'm currently driving is capable of such things as these is capable of being fitted with a crane. Uh, otherwise, I think the truck back at the garage is. So at first, though, since we've now finally are able to actually drive this this monstrosity, I'm going to see how I can get it out of here. Uh, actually, that should be pretty easy. I just kind of need to go back the way I can actually go. Yeah, I can go up the river, the, the rapids. Oh, I could probably just go this way. Yoink! And then uh, this is where the bridge is up to the garage. New truck, everybody. New truck. Uh, let's turn all-wheel drive off. Yes, capabilities. Well, capabilities except for a tight turning radius. We have achieved them. Farewell, blue truck. You are probably never going to be used again, but you've certainly picked out a nice scenic area to be rusting away for the rest of eternity. All right, all-wheel drive is now on. It clearly was something you needed. Uh, let's try to get out of the water, actually. It feels like this truck, despite seeming to have beefier looks is not as capable as the other eight-wheel truck that we have. 
I could be wrong. This just could be my own observations from what I'm doing right now, but uh, seems the case. This is the one we had in the last map, the, the Plains map. But, uh... Seems capable enough, but it just doesn't seem to have quite the... Oh, God. God. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what it is about it, but it just doesn't... Yep. Being as it gets stuck sometimes. Wow, this is not something we need to be seeing at this moment. Alright, hold on. Let's... Let's re-establish our dominance here. Whoa, getting swept away, getting swept away. Alright, alright. Maybe that's not the way to cross. Maybe we should get up on the flat land here first. Or maybe we should just slowly slide into the river. What the heck was that about? Forward! Alright. Maybe that's not the way to go after all. Let's go up the river. In a van down by the river. In an eight-wheeled Russian tank down by the river. I don't quite... Yeah, like I said, I don't quite understand the geography of this river. It seems to be very shallow and low right there, but certainly picks up once you go down 20 feet. All right, all right. Very nice. Four damage. Uh, turning diff lock off gave us a little bit tighter of a turning radius, but... Uh, which way do I go? Do I go this way? Yeah, I think I just made very rough waypoints. So let's go this way. turn diff lock back on. It doesn't seem to know what it's doing. Uh, which way am I going here? Oh god. Take that, trees! Nope. You will get no respect from me. What did I do? Did I go the wrong way that I did not expect to go? I guess so. Alright. That's fine. <laughs> Ten point turn. Ah, go. There's another big rock. Easy. All right, all right, all right. We made it. All right. the The waypoints are a bit screwed up now, but uh, I really didn't want to have to cross this river with this very rickety bridge. But we're gonna try it. Okay, maybe not like that, but. All right, we're gonna fuel this guy up. We're gonna see what attachments he can take. I don't think there are that many, to be honest, and I don't know that he can actually take a crane. Be very careful going over the bridge. All right. Ow! Takes a lot of damage, that's for sure. And... We are hopefully going to make it here. Uh, go! Forward! Oh my gosh. Yeah, really not as capable. Seems to really be struggling here. Yeah, I think that truck can take a crane, can't it? Load up on fuel. Wait, stop rolling. We can have nothing that will help us. Uh, no. Oh, okay, yeah, I remember. Um, dang it. Dang it. Uh, dang it. Uh, okay. Um, well, you're actually going to be a little bit less useful than I had hoped. Yeah, now I, now I remember that this can have the... It's like a tow truck, almost. Can't use it to actually lift logs or anything, but uh, in case we do get in a sticky situation with one of our other trucks, we can perchance get ourselves free. Let's see if this guy can have a crane.
If so, he's going to be our crane guy. All right, let's... No, this guy can't. Did I... Utility attachment, tractor, garage, fuel, log cart, carriage, cabin protection. Yeah, there's no crane support. I mean, if I add the tractor, does any of these things give me a crane? The cistern trailer and the utility trailer. That's the same thing I just... Oh. This is, uh... This is news to me. I think, no, I think I've already figured this out in the previous episode. It's been a while since I played. Ha. Huh. Ha. Huh. Okay. Um. Hmm. This. Ooh, lights. Disco. Um, okay, so what's my, what's, what's the situation on the type of... This guy over here has a crane. He's almost out of fuel. Uh, that is... Do I have two trucks over there? Or is that just pointing at the garage? Yeah, that's kind of new. There's an update, and I think all these arrows are new. Uh, yeah, that's just the Jeep. He's pretty much useless at this point. Um, there's fuel over there. The D-537 is the truck... That's going to carry. That is a fuel truck, also useless. Um, hmm. This is a predicament indeed. Let's see about... Can this guy have a crane? Because really, I'm just looking for... Okay, there's nothing in the fuel tank. I'm just looking for something that can lift and load the lumber, and once it's done with that, I, I don't care. Where am I even going here? <laughs> Let's plot a course. All right, uh... I need to get to the garage to see what this guy can hold. Nope, no, no, no! <laughs> <laughs> oh, there! Oh, there's there's the clock. I was wondering. I'm like, isn't there a clock? I couldn't find the clock, but it, you have to be in the in the map. Got it. Got it. Oh, wait a minute. Where's? Okay, it's this way. Hello. Watch where you're going. Whoo! On the highway. Old D seven seven four. Getting the work done. I don't know. <laughs> wow, we're clipping along here. <laughs> this is the fastest we've ever gone in this game. Yeah, this is a map that I feel like would possibly be fun in multiplayer if you can arrange some sort of... Whoa! Some sort of race around the uh, the paved road here. <laughs> uh, even though I'm not sure our collision's a thing to the... To the... Uh, the vehicles even collide with each other, because I know a lot of other things don't work that you might expect. Alright, be careful here. You're very top-heavy. Oh. Oh, okay. Alright, I have a feeling this guy's actually going to need a lot of momentum to get up here. Ugh. Yep, it's already kind of bogging down. Go, Speed Racer! No, don't shift. Uh, let's... Oh god, oh Jesus! No, no! Hold on, hold on, hold on. That's really finicky, I just wish it was like in the tech demo, a selection. Like, okay, first, second, high, low gear, instead of the... jimmying around with the manual transmission. If I was able to play with my Logitech G27 racing wheel, perhaps, that would make more sense. Oh, okay, I repaired and fueled up. But I want to see what attachments you can take. Alright, now let's see. 
You can uninstall that. And cart with crane. Thank you, Jeebus. That is exactly what I want. I'm going to give you the off-road wheels, because up until now you've been just using those highway wheels. Uh, should I bother with the trailer, even? I mean, it's set up to have a trailer. But should I even bother with it? Would that just cause more problems? Position your... Well, screw you in my position of my truck. I'll position my truck however dang well please. I guess. I mean, once I'm done with this job, I could always load myself up with medium logs and and try to complete the uh, the mission that way. Well, that looks just wrong and incorrect, doesn't it? Ah, <laughs> you've got some got some problems there with your your intersecting vectors and Victor's vector. Uh, all right. Well, I guess I'll give this a shot. I guess. I guess. So we're going to travel g very delicately back across that bridge. Down, down the, the open road, the highway, and it was kind of an interesting finagling to get myself into here, but then we can load up on long logs. Hopefully this truck is heavy duty enough that it won't tip over whence carrying long logs. Uh, the cart might have been a mistake, I can always detach it. Wee! Drifto! <laughs> alright, alright, this is where we gotta take it easy. Let's get up nice and straight and steady. Take a 20 damage, that's a good start. And just power through, power through. Alright, we made it. I'm very scared of that bridge, yet I have yet to have any problems with it. Of course, now that I've said that, look forward to next episode when we... <laughs> When we finally tip over the bridge. Ow! Yeah, this is something I remember about these trucks. They're not particularly sturdy. Yeehaw! Boing, boing. Whoa, whoa. Oh. Boing. Oh, didn't take any damage there. That's responsible driving there, kids. Says as he barrels forward at 60 miles an hour with a cart, a rusty cart behind him. A little bit of a jump. Whee! Boeing. Whoa, drift! Okay, alright, let's be easy there. <laughs> Take it easy there. Grid. Auto sports. Was that a way I could have gone to get into there? Um, yeah, I remember this kind of being a little bit of a hidden and difficult pathway. Yeah, with all the rocks. Oh, this is... How did I get in there? I think this is the way. Yeah, let's go around the long way here that aren't the rocks. And promptly run flat into a tree. Oh, okay, we missed it. Got it. What was that noise? It's not like a horse. Nay, I say. Nay. Yeah, it is kind of a... Uh, just power through it. We have arrived. We have arrived. Okay, so the... The long logs are over there. So let's actually... Position ourselves properly next to the long logs. So we'll just be able to pick them up. Hopefully, and just conveniently put them on the trailer there. That might be a little bit close, to be honest, but uh, we can kind of remedy that a little bit. And also jackknife it, that's great. How's this? Uh, back up a little bit. There we go. Okay, stop right there. And let's... 
Extend anchors. Position anchors. Push anchors. Very nice. Let's change the truck. This is all getting very complicated and complex. Um, how do I want to set this guy up? Got to start the engine. I don't think I want to get too close, but then again, I don't want to get too far either. So let's... Try... Let's do this. All right, stop right there. Oh, that's too close, that's too close. You're too close, man. All right. Wow, I'm digging myself into a mighty, mighty deep grave here. That is not reassuring. Oh, I've pressed buttons I did not mean to press. All right, that's strange. That was not like that before. All right, let's unpack the cart and tip ourselves over. All right, and boop, like that. Is that good positioning? Are we all kind of straight? Yeah, we are. Um, I could probably move up a little bit. Yeah, like right there. And I can turn off the engine to save the fuel. Whew, this is getting real. This is getting real, everybody. <laughs> I've never picked up a long log before. What? Beg your pardon? Come again? Uh, crane. Ooh. All right. Okay. So it begins. <laughs> ha. All right. So uh, this camera angle is terrible. Why is why are they red? Does that mean I can't pick them up? I hope that's not the case. Uh. Let's. Oh, that's the crane grab. Okay. Okay. Let's position that. Let's try to uh, choose a point that's in the middle of the log. Nope. Let's turn off the crane grappler and actually be able to move the up and down motion. Oh! Oh, that's like a perfect spot to grab. Uh, crane grab. Crane lift. Oh, that is actually a little bit off-centered, but... Yeah, that's a lot of bit off-centered. All right, let's... Uh, oh god, whoa, whoa, okay, things are, oh, no, no, up, 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 up. Okay, all right, this is a delicate procedure, everybody. Ooh, watch your heads, watch your heads! Oh god, oh no, no, I want to go up. No, no, not down, up. Yes! This is not at all the way you should be doing this. Oh, I almost dropped it. No, I want to go up. Yeah, I should try to... I should aim to, uh... Aim for more of the middle of the log, I suppose, next time. Wait, where am I at? Oh, God, the camera angles, they stink! Oh, here we go. Alright. Uh, well, I'm actually kind of... Whoa, okay, I'm not anymore. Oh, no, up. I'll learn the... Oh, yeah, yeah, just drop it right there. Down. Oh, this is, like, perfect. Drop it. And... Uh, let me actually... Crane grab. Oh, wow. <laughs> Ooh, don't touch it. Don't touch it. It's very sensitive. Uh, <laughs> all right. Let, oh, this only has 180 degrees of rotation. Yeah, let's keep our center of gravity a little bit close to the truck. Venas. Venas indeed. All right, now let's... What is out again? That is out. This is up and that's down. Oh, let's pull it forward. Is that about the center of the log? That's about the center of the log. I don't want to pick up both of them. There we go. Yeah, get out of the way. Ooh, I'm like a... Oh, wait, no, come back. You're, you're the one I want. Oh, look at the balanced grasp on this log. Yeah, watch your heads, duck, everybody. Duck. Whoa, whoa, I'm like tipping... Oh, yes. Okay. Oh. oh, this is the part where my own trailer becomes a problem. Move nice and slow. I'm trying with all my might to be as slow and steady as I possibly can. 
Wow, I'm getting skilled at this. Oh, don't break it. All right, now let's, oh, no, no, let's swing around. And oh, this one's a little bit close, but I think we can, oh, no, no. We can grab it. Indeed we can. Indeed we can. Okay. This actually, now that I know what I'm... Whoa, watch your face there. Now that I know what I'm doing here, it's a little bit more of a feasible... Wait, how do I go out? I want to go out a little bit. No, no, not in. Out. Okay. And down. It's a little bit more of a feasible... Whoops, sorry. Take that out of my check. More of a feasible method of... Packing one's load. All right, so now how do I say? Do I? I'm assuming I have to be in this truck to say yes. I wish to pack the load. Is there a problem, officer? What's going on? Oh, do I need to have the engine going? Oh, I do. Position your truck properly. Screw you. It's ready to pack. Um. It's like green. All right, hold on. Let me. All right, okay. I'm like perfectly perpendicular and safe here. Position your truck properly. What is, what is? Oh, Jesus, no, 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 no. Don't, oh God. Oh, I hate that. It's the acceleration key is the same thing as Pack up the cart. Ready to pack. Oh, that actually helped. We did it, everybody. <laughs> Why am I so surprised? I'm not very confident in my abilities. Wow. Okay. So now the mission becomes delivering the load. What just happened? Uh, delivering the load. Somehow getting out of this, this hell hole. It almost seems like there's a road over this way, but I'm not going to take my chances. Uh, delivering the load out of here and we can hopefully just complete that one, as I've learned, southwest objective in one fell swoop. A swoop, I say. There might be a way to travel through these backwoods areas, but I really don't know if that's possible. Um, this truck is fairly capable and uh, now that I have the other eight-wheel truck at my disposal, I might be able to simply use that. Oh, that's the garage. I actually want to go to the objective. Nope, that, that is all That is all the waypoints you get. Yeah, there might be a way to come in from... Come in from behind, huh? What? I beg your pardon? But, uh... Woo! How did that happen? I do not know. All right, let's not be in reverse. Let's be in automatic mode and start the quest! Oh god, this is already not <laughs> feeling too great, to be honest. I've got diff lock and all-wheel drive on. Hopefully this is the worst part of the journey. <laughs> Alright, I guess I'm going to the left of this tree. Or I'm just going to knock it down completely. Yeah, the all the weight on the back tires does not allow for the best steering capabilities. But we're going to begin the journey... And pick it up in the next episode of Spin Tires. Thanks so much for watching. See you next time.